Okay, again, let's start this second video for today from Sean Marcus Secondary School's English Department. Let's go to continue our student book in your student book, page number 45. Complaints, complaints, four meaning and functions. Okay, in the first video we talked about object pronouns. In the second video now, we will talk about need, want, and like, plus infinitive. Need, يحتاج, want, you read, like, يحب, أو يفضل, plus infinitive, يليها, أو يتبعت, following by, the infinitive, اللي هو مصدر الفعل. Use the full infinitive, Full infinitive. What's the meaning of full infinitive? The whole mazhar is common, which is two plus the base form of the verb. Two plus the base form of the verb. Like needs to buy, want to do, like to help. Okay, let's return it back to the grammar. Use the full infinitive again, which is what is the meaning of full infinitive? To plus the base form of the verb. After the following verbs, when, بعد هذه الأفعال, need, want, and like. For example, if we wanted to use the full infinitive after need, can you give me an example? Yeah. The first example is she needs to buy some snacks. Needs to followed by full infinitive. Full infinitive, via to plus pi. The second example is, he doesn't want to do the dishes. Again, he doesn't want to do the dishes. Want to do, full infinitive. The third example, I like to help my mother. Like here, followed by two plus the full infinitive, which is hell. Right. Okay. So, the first one, object pronouns. The second one, need, want, like, plus an infinitive. القاعدة الثالثة اللي معنا اليوم يا شباب. Imperatives. أفعال الأمر. Imperatives and two word verbs. Not one word, but two words. Like what? First, let's discuss what it consists of. Two word verbs are common in English. They have a verb plus a particle. When a verb like turn, particle, lower preposition, particle. Object pronouns always come between the verb and the particle. So we have three sections. First one, two word verbs are common in English. They have a verb. And the verb plus an article, verb, and this is the article. Right? Object pronouns always come. Object pronouns, like what? Come between the verb and the particle. For example, turn off your cell phone. Turn off your cell phone. So, turn is a verb, off is a particle. We can divide them. And what? Mm, the object pronoun between them. Like, turn is a phone off. Again, turn off the cell phone. Turn the cell phone off. So we separated between turn and off and put the object pronouns. Right? Okay. So can you give me a second example? 